Hey Sharon, this is Devin from SEO Dallas, Texas. In this quick video, I'm going to show you three easy ways you can beat your competition online starting today. You're probably asking why I'm making this video. It's really simple. I found out a little while ago there's a lot of small business owners out there that are spending all their time running their business, taking care of their customers, and they don't really have the time to learn how to make the internet work for them and bring in more of those customers. And the only thing typically holding them back from hiring a marketing agency is they don't know who is an expert and who is not an expert. And so I found that by making these attack plans and giving them away for free, a lot of those business owners still end up raising their hands and going, you know what, Devin, I like you. Take care of this for me. So if at the end of this all you see I've got some tricks up my sleeve and I can really help you, give me a call and we can chat. And if you want to take this information and apply it yourself, that is totally okay too. This is just free education with no strings attached. Now the three things I'm going to talk about today, Sharon, are going to be content, backlinks, and citations. So content is everything that's on the front page of your website that Google can crawl through to determine what keywords to rank you for and where to rank you for those keywords. So obviously you want that content stuffed with keywords that you're targeting, such as like flooring and Carrollton. Now this includes all the text you can read, all the text banner images, and whatever images are saved as. An authoritative Google uh, website in Google's eyes nowadays has between 1,500 and 2,000 words. So looking at your website, this is a very, very good looking website. I love all the different examples you have of like what type of floors you do. It's a rotating gallery. It's really nice. As far as content goes, you're going to want to take it from the 150 that it's at right now up to about 1500. So Google knows that you're the authority. If you look at your competitors, first US floors, they have quite a bit. And then if you look at like flooring, Draper's floors, they have a lot of content on their page. So again, 1500 or 2000 words, you're going to blow them out of the water. Now content is king, but it's not the end all fix all. The next thing you want to look at is going to be citation or backlinks. Backlinks are important because Google's like a popularity contest and they look at how many other websites are linking to your website, driving traffic from their website to yours. And not all uh, backlinks are created equal. You get a lot more power from other flooring companies linking to you than you do from like Pizza Hut linking to you. You're not a pizza company. So I use a tool to check this out. It's called Arefs. It costs about a thousand bucks a month depending on what plan you use, but it gives you a lot of really valuable data on what's going on in the back end of websites. So here's your website. It says you have 43 websites pointing back at you. If you look at first US floors, they got 55 pointing at them, and then Draper Floors has 85 pointing at them. So I'd recommend adding at least 50 to 75 more websites pointing to you. And a good way to do this is to go see where, uh, what links are, are linking to your competitors and go take those exact same ones that, as long as they're good quality, like they have to do with flooring and construction. So like home design will be good, home design, um, bathroom design, bathroom vanities, home wallpaper, wood decor, fantastic floors. Those will all be really good ones for you. Last thing I'm going to tell you about is going to be citations. These are important because when someone needs a flooring contractor in Carrollton and they're ready to buy, typically they call the first person that seems trustworthy to them. So you want to be that person. And so a good way to do this is to, uh, or a lot these ads right here, a lot of people skip them because one, many people have, have ad blockers, but two, there's a lot of people out there that have had bad experiences with them. And so, um, they just skip right by them. So the best place to rank yourself is right here in the Google My Business or local map hack ranking. To get here, you need more citations than your competitors. Citations are anywhere where your name, your address, and your phone number are listed in different directories across the web. And directories are just area or just websites um, that allow you to list your business's information, like Yelp, Yext, Yellow Pages, White Pages, Facebook, Home Advisor, Angie's List. These are all really common ones. And so a good strategy here is to go figure out what directories your competitors are listing themselves in, go list yourself in those exact same directories, and add a bunch more on top. I always recommend 30 to 40%. That way, once you take that number one spot, you have a nice space cushion. And all you have to do every month is maybe an hour or two of work, adding a couple of citations so they never catch up to you and you keep taking all those easy to close customers. So Sharon, that's all I've got for you. Again, I went over content. I'd recommend getting your website up to 1,500, 2,000 words. Backlinks, you're gonna to wanna to add about 60 websites pointing to you. And then citations, figure out what directories your competitors are listing themselves in, list yourself in those exact same directories and add a bunch more on top. So Sharon, if you wanna do this yourself, again, that's totally okay. This is free education. This custom video I made is just a gift for you guys. The only thing I ask for in return is just a couple words of feedback as a response to this email. If you want me to help you, check out our website, seodallastx.com. Our phone number is 214-441-6737. And if you're looking at our website on mobile, click this link and it goes right to our phones. Thanks for watching this, guys. Have a great day.